My name is Rosie Goldsmith and I'm here talking about Commonwealth Shorts. I'm delighted to introduce you to Kareem Mortimer from the Bahamas. Kareem is writer and director of a short film called Passage. Now, Kareem, why did you make Passage? Okay, so Passage essentially is a story of a young girl and her little brother on a live or die ship traveling from Haiti through to Florida, through the Bahamas. And I was inspired by this film when I was nine years old. I was watching the news with my mother one day and I remember seeing the body of dead, bloated immigrants that are washed up on shore. They, apparently they were locked or, or trapped in a hole by a smuggler that didn't let them out. I was always obsessed with this image. I was always obsessed with the story because I always wondered who these people were, what were their lives like, what made them take the risk that they took. And so that was the inspiring image for me to, to dig a little deeper and find a story and create a backstory that told the story of migration. It's a grim story. I mean, it is about economic migrants and it's, it tells a story of a, of a tragedy too. Mm. I mean, why this particular story? Because the brief for this is relationships. Yes, yes. Why is this particular story? Because, because it's something that still happens. So it's something that, that, that we don't talk about enough. It's something that we don't... As Caribbean filmmakers, as Commonwealth filmmakers, we have a very unique perspective and a, and a very fresh way of, of telling stories, especially when you're from the location. And there weren't a lot of stories from this location talking about this topic. And so that was, I felt that it was important um, to tell it from someone, even going back to a childhood memory of someone that lives with this we constantly. We have such a different image of the Bahamas, don't yes. we? I mean, that's, it's, it's so important to see the underside as well. Too. Yes. You know, the central relationship is Sandrine and her brother. Now, tell us about those two powerful okay. characters. So Sandrine and, and Etienne are on, the, are on the ship. And the thing about the live or die ship is that communicable diseases are very scary. Um, and so when someone has a communicable disease, uh, what happens is that you have to throw them overboard. Um, Etienne has dysentery, and so, uh, so Sandrine has to hide that from the other occupants on the ship, hoping that she would make it to shore in time before they discover his illness. And we're not going to give away the ending, but yes. um, it is a very strong film, and I know that the filming conditions were quite difficult too. Three days on a ship, on water, um, in August, very hot. I mean, it must have been quite, quite tough. Yeah, it is quite tough, but to be a filmmaker, you have to have selective amnesia. <laughs> And so every, every project has, um, has its challenges. And we, we did film in August, uh, which is the hottest month. And we were in the belly of a ship. But um, I could just imagine. I can't remember because I don't think we would continue to make films if we remember how painful it can be sometimes. It's a very powerful film. Thank you, Kareem Mortimer. No, thank very you much very indeed. much. Thank you.